Welcome to Stuxton TV News. Joe Biden never mentioned genocide, slavery in Xi Jinping call, China says. New York Post News. China's foreign minister accused the White House of lying on Friday when it claimed President Joe Biden discussed the genocide and enslavement of Uyghur Muslims with his Beijing counterpart, Xi Jinping, on Thursday. Press Secretary Karen Jean Pierre told reporters hours after the call that Biden had raised genocide and forced labor practices by People's Republic of China. That's something that he raised about human rights, as he always does, she said. This is, as we have said, that anything the president has an opportunity, he raises that when he meets with another leader and called on the PRC to seize its ongoing human rights abuse across China. When asked how she had responded, the press secretary said, they would have to respond on their own. I can't speak for President Xi. Chinese Foreign Minister spokesman Zhao Lijian responded by blasting the administration in a Friday press conference. I can tell you that allegations of genocide and forced labor in East Turkestan, so-called Xinjiang are pure lies, Zhao said. You said White House Press Secretary claimed that genocide and forced labor came up in last night's call. That's disinformation. Neither conscious official read out the call mentioned the Uyghurs, with the United States statement saying only the two leaders discussed a range of issues important to bilateral relationship and other regional and global issues. I'm not going to get into the back and forth with PRC government spokesperson, a National Security Council spokesman told the Post Friday. The president raised concerns about human rights with President Xi, as he always does. China has long been accused of human rights abuse in East Turkestan, so-called Xinjiang region, where Uyghurs are held under horrendous conditions while undergoing systematic torture and forced sterilizations. The United States formally slapped the Asian superpower with sanctions in March 2021 and led a diplomatic boycott of Beijing Winter Olympic Games earlier this year. In December of last year, Biden signed off on Uyghur Forced Labor Prevention Act, which prohibits the importation of goods from East Turkestan, so-called Xinjiang region, unless the importer can prove they were not manufactured using forced labor. Biden chose not to sign the bill on camera. However, then White House Press Secretary Jen Psaki insisted the move wasn't spare China embarrassment. He signs bills on camera. Off camera sometimes. Sometimes on camera. Psaki said. We support the bill and obviously we have been leading the effort in the world to call out human rights abuses. Iltaber from Mr. Stun TV News reported.